Hello, everybody. Today we will be solving problem seven of the 2021 Amy 2. The problem reads Let A, B, C, and D be real numbers that satisfy the system of equations A plus B equals negative three, AB plus BC plus CA equals negative four, ABC plus BCD plus CDA plus DAB equals 14, and ABCD equals 30. There exist relatively prime positive integers M and N such that a squared plus b squared plus c squared plus d squared equals m over n. Find m plus n. Okay, so what we are going to do is we are going to um, first take a look at these last two equations, since they're the only ones that have all the variables. Okay, so we can write the third one as a, b, c plus b, c, d, plus C D A plus D A B um, equals 14. And then we can write as A B C plus after factoring out a D from the last three terms, we get B C plus C A plus A B equals 14. But a B plus B C plus C A is negative four. So we get A B C minus four D equals 14. So A B C equals 14 plus four D. And from this fourth equation, we see A B C D is 30, but A B C is 14 plus four D. So we get 14 plus 4d times d is 30. And expanding this out, we get 4d squared plus 14d minus 30 equals 0, or 2d squared plus 7d minus 15 equals 0. We can factor this as... 2d minus 3 times d plus 5 equals 0. So either d is 3 halves or negative 5. Um, and we can try out each value of d to see what works. Okay, first we're going to try out this value, d equals negative 5. So a, b, c equals 14 plus four times D, which is negative six. All right. And then we can get that this is equal to um, a, B times C equals negative six. And then we can do the same thing we did before, which is A, B plus B, C plus C, A, we can factor out a C from, which is C times A plus B equals negative four. But since, look over here, A plus B is negative three, we get A, B minus three C equals negative four. So A of B equals three C minus four. So A, B times C is negative six, which means that three C minus four times C equals negative six. Three C squared minus four C plus six equals zero. And using the quadratic formula, we get C equals negative B four plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac, 4 squared minus 4 times 3 times 6, all over 2a, which is 6. This is equal to 4 plus or minus the square root of 16 minus 72 over 6. And this is not going to be real because 16 minus 72 is a negative number. And anytime you're taking a square root of a negative number, you're going to get an imaginary number or a complex number. Um, but we specified way at the beginning of the problem statement that A, B, C, and D are real numbers, which means that there are no solutions for this case.
So D cannot be negative five. So we must have D is three halves. So here's that. And then we, we're just left with D is three halves. And ABC equals 14 plus four times three over two, which is 20. And once again, we have a b minus three c equals negative four. So three c minus four times c equals 20. And then this time we get three c squared minus four c equals 20. So we can bring a 20 over to the left. 4c minus 20 equals zero. And then we can factor this as 3c minus 10, c plus two equals zero. And we get c equals 10 over three or negative two. So A, B equals three C minus four. Okay, so we are gonna try both values of C. If C is 10 thirds, A, B is three times 10 thirds minus four, which is six. So A plus B equals negative three. And then we can substitute b equals negative three minus a into a b equals six so a times negative three minus a equals to six which means that a squared plus three a plus six equals zero and then we use quadratic formula on this because it's not easily factorable we get negative three plus or minus the square root of three squared, which is nine, minus four times four AC, four times one times six, which is 24, all over two. But the thing inside the square root is once again negative, nine minus 24 is negative, which means that in this case, A would not be a real number. So we can discard, we can discard this case, which means that C is not equal to 10 thirds. So C has to be equal to negative two. Then A, B equals three times negative two minus four, which is negative 10. And A plus B equals negative three. So we apply the substitution B equals negative three minus A again. We get A times negative three minus A equals negative 10 or a squared plus three a minus 10 equals zero. And we can factor this as a plus five, a minus two equals zero, which means that a either equals two or negative five and b would equal the other one. So if a equals two, b equals five or if b, a equals two, B equals negative five, since A plus B is negative three. And if A equals negative five, B equals two. These two cases are symmetric. A equals negative five, excuse me. Okay, so we can just assume that A is negative five and B equals two. Um, either way, A squared plus B squared plus C squared plus D squared. Is negative five squared plus two squared plus negative two squared plus three halves squared. And you can check that this simplifies to 141 over four. Um, and 141 and four are relatively prime. So the answer is 141 plus four, which is 145. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.